Around 1.30 a.m., the Waterville Fire Department was dispatched to 22 School Street for a reported structure fire. Upon arrival, they found uh, heavy fire on the second and third floor at, this, at that time. Uh, there were some occupants home at that time and they quickly determined that there was not a life safety issue, that everybody had made it out safely. According to a Facebook post by Waterville Fire, a second alarm was requested to dispatch neighboring fire departments to help contain the fire to the second and third floors. Neighbors who observed the fire say it was an unfortunate spectacle. Well, I woke up about 2 o'clock this morning to the sound of something like, sounded like somebody was plowing my driveway. So I go to the window and say, what the heck's going on? I open the window and that house was on fire. The whole top floor was engulfed in flames. They had to go up over the house with the hook and ladder and spray down onto the fire. According to Waterville's fire chief, Sean Essler, it should be noted the residents of the building were alerted to the fire by a working smoke detector. It's incredibly important that, you know, cases like this, we highlight the necessity to have good working smoke and carbon monoxide detectors, and that likely led to them being able to get out of the building today. After the fire was put out, the house was deemed completely unlivable. At this time, the American Red Cross is working with the displaced family to provide for any immediate needs they may have. In Waterville, Devin Dagnall, ABC7 and Fox 22 News.